I've been in the art gallery business for 20 years, and there's one thing I've learned that you have to be careful what you bring in and how you handle it. These are my tips on what not to do with your art when you bring it in to me for potentially sale or evaluation. And unfortunately, I see this over and over again. For the last 20 years, it just shocked me that people do this, but they keep doing it. Today is going to be on Native American material and what you need not to do to the material when you bring it in. Navajo rugs. Do not wash them. You'd be shocked. People think that by putting it in the washer, they want to clean it up before they bring it to me and show it to me. So it'll be nice and clean. It bleeds if it has any reds or blues or blacks, and you can literally destroy the textile. Also, don't put it in the dryer if you happen to put it in the washer for some reason, because then it fluffs it out as well as the other problem with the bleeds. So just bring it in, let the professionals look at it, and we'll tell you what needs to be done, if anything. Jewelry. Here is the classic. I see this amazingly, I would say, almost every month. I have some wonderful little old lady who brings me all her Indian jewelry she's collected, and she spent all night cleaning it. She got all that old tarnish off, every little bit. I've seen them where they, you can just tell when they walk in. They're very happy. They always say, oh, I cleaned it for you. What we even tell people when they're going to bring us in jewelry, don't touch it, don't clean it, because it's like furniture. You see the Antiques Roadshow with the American furniture and somebody stripped off the great old patina. It's the same with jewelry. If you clean off that wonderful patination, it took oxidation to do, you ruin some of the value, and sometimes you ruin it a lot. So please, whatever you do, do not do that. Three, for anything like pottery or baskets, don't clean them. Let us look at them. A lot of people on pottery want to do, put some kind of film on it, something to shine it up. You can take off the original patina, you can change it, you can affect it, and if for some reason it might have had some old restoration, you might affect that restoration where it smears as a problem. For baskets, I see people oil them. You can change the patination and the color. This is not a good thing to do. If you'll just follow some common sense guidelines, if you have something old, you think it's valuable, don't touch it. Just bring it in and let the professionals like myself look at it. We'll tell you what to do.